the electric mobility is developing to another level with the introduction of electric aircraft. NASA had been researching ideas that could lead to the development of electric propulsion powered aircraft since a while ago. The electric aircraft could be much quieter, efficient and environmental friendly. NASA's scalable convergent electric propulsion technology and operations research develops X-57 Maxwell electric propulsion airplane. NASA planned to convert the Italian aircraft Technam into the first manned explained to feature a distributed electric propulsion system. Later on, they had completed the ground testing on their first electric airplane, the X-57 Maxwell. It successfully demonstrated the aircraft's ability to transmit its telemetry signal, allowing the team the capability to track mission-critical data during the flight. They had received the data on the ground during X-57's flight tests, where it will be monitored in real time by the project team during flight operations. It would be helpful for NASA since it seeks to help set certification standards for future electric aircraft. NASA confirmed that the completion of this round of tests, which took place at NASA's Armstrong Flight Research Center in Edwards, California, marked continued progress on X-57's functional ground testing phase. The telemetry testing was conducted by establishing a radio frequency link between the aircraft and the downlink equipment of NASA telemetry van. The X-57's two antennas, a top and a bottom antenna were tested together first in the flight configuration and then each antenna individually. The transmitter was operated by an avionics technician in the X-57 cockpit based on the instructions from the text conductor. The instrumentation engineer and the telemetry technician monitored the downlink signal in the van and was able to confirm that the data messages were being received as expected. Among the data monitored throughout the test, the X-57 team specifically looked at R of power. This measurement allowed engineers to observe the signal strength of the overall transmission. The team also looked at the bandwidth and sender frequency of the signal pattern to determine if the system is operating with the bounds of the allocated frequency range. The testing indicated no major anomalies in the x ability to transmit data. In modification 4, NASA has the x in its all-electric configuration. Each wingtip of the aircraft has a large electric motor. In addition to that, they have added 12 smaller high-lift motors and propellers on the wings to make capable of taking off at standard speeds. These 12 motors located across the wing help out to increase the airflow so that the wing produces lift even when aircraft is flying slowly. These motors can activate during takeoff and deactivate during cruise mode. The blades of the propellers powered by these motors will be folded during the cruise to reduce the drag. Electric aircraft present a wide array of potential benefits to aviation, including increased efficiency, reduced or eliminated in-flight carbon emissions, and flight that is quieter for communities on the ground. NASA expects that X-57 will help set certification standards as this electric aircraft makes begin to emerge. Stay tuned for more updates. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to our channel for more interesting videos about electric vehicles.